In a first-of-its-kind case for Bucks County, a man pleaded guilty today in connection to a new crime in the digital age called sextortion. Eyewitness News reporter Matt Petrillo reports from the Bucks County Courthouse in Doylestown. Prosecutors tell us Ian Pisarchik sexually extorted more than a dozen victims. One of them was so distraught, she committed suicide. This is her. The father of Lindsay Pacone of Ben Salem wore a shirt with a photo of his daughter on it inside the Bucks County Courthouse Tuesday. Prosecutors say someone over Snapchat harassed her to send explicit photos of herself and even threatened her back in 2016. After complying, the 21 year old killed herself the next day. It's hard to lose a child, especially over something like this. 26 year old Ian Pisarchuk admitted in front of a Bucks County judge to sextorting Pacone and a total of 15 victims. It's a relatively new statute that came into effect about two years ago. Um, so I believe this is the first case that we've charged it and now have had someone plead guilty to it in Bucks County. So he is facing about 65 total counts um, he pled guilty to today. But Pisarchuk's crimes don't account for Pacone's death. So her family and state lawmakers are trying to change that. The sextortion is already acknowledged as a law. My bill, Lindsay's law, would strengthen penalties for those who commit sex torsion, and then that leads to bodily harm and or death. I just hope the law is passed and it helps other people. And Ian Pasarchuk is expected to have his sentencing in June. He faces about 100 years in state prison. In Doylestown, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.